Hello Superset Maniacs and welcome back to my channel. And welcome to our first episode of this brand new series on the channel called uh, YouTubers Face Off, in which two bodybuilding content YouTubers are going against each other in a bodybuilding comparison video. Today we're going to see Marks Max Muscle and Sanj Bodybuilding facing each other in a video footage bodybuilding comparison. I say this is the first episode of a new series because I really hope this becomes a thing. So if any YouTuber or uh, social media bodybuilding content creator wants to be a part of this, just DM me on Instagram at uh, the Super Setman. But for now, I have to thank uh, Mark and Sound because they picked me for this comparison. I'm really honored to do this and I hope you guys will enjoy this video. Before we begin, let's find out who these uh, guys are first. I would be very surprised if you're watching my channel and don't know who Marx Max Muscle is though. If you guys are into bodybuilding comparisons, Marx Max Muscle is the channel you should be following. He doesn't just review past bodybuilding shows or do dream comparisons, he basically does any imaginable bodybuilding comparison on his channel with his uh, fan request uh, Friday matchups in which during every Friday he does 4 fan requested bodybuilding comparison, comparisons and also with his uh, You Pick Tuesday matchups in which he also picks requested comparisons from the comment section. I believe that on Fridays he does the first uh, request uh, from the comment section and on Tuesdays he picks the most popular request from the comments. Marx also has the Wednesdays dedicated to the ladies in which he does woman bodybuilding comparisons. I see his channel as the most complete bodybuilding comparisons database on the internet. Sound Bodybuilding on the other hand focuses on nutritional information, product reviews, workout tips. Basically this is a channel where you should be learning how to train and what to eat to get uh, the best results out of your workouts. He also posts uh, contest information on the channel, bodybuilding routines and show reviews. Take a look on his channel if you haven't done it yet. You can find a link to his channel in the description as well as for Mark's Max Muscle. Okay, so both of these guys sent me their posing routines and I have to tell you that they did not make things too easy for me in terms of camera angles. Mark's routine is, is uh, recorded from a lower angle than the sound. Mark is also way more conditioned, I mean he would probably win this comparison only based on that. However sound is a much bigger man, he's huge, he's over 6 feet tall I believe, whereas Mark's is uh, like uh, 5 foot 7. This is exciting, I believe we spent too much time on the introduction already, so without further ado, let's start this comparison. And we begin with the front double biceps pose. See guys, conditioning wise it's, not, it's no contest here. Mark really focused on that. He looks almost in contest shape whereas Sanch is definitely in the off season. Not sure what he's trying to do but from what I'm seeing this is nowhere near contest shape. He doesn't present any muscle separation at all, no striations whatsoever. Mark looks sharp. You can notice some separation through the arms, through the quads, so yeah, based on conditioning alone, Mark should already be winning this one, no doubt. But from a muscle point of view, I don't know, from what I'm seeing here, I believe Sanj would still dominate Mark if they had similar conditioning, especially through the legs. Don't get me wrong, Mark has great legs. It's just that we're used to seeing pro bodybuilders that have uh, very different proportions when it comes to the legs versus the rest of the body ratio and I believe uh, Sanchez's legs are proportionally bigger than Mark's, closer to what we're used to seeing on pro bodybuilders. Anyway, like I said, the camera angles are very different, they present different levels of conditioning so these kind of aspects may be playing tricks on me. Ah, not to forget, I did not focus too much on scaling, as this was virtually impossible to make it look like they were standing next to each other. 
Some other details that could be observed in this pose is that Mark has the shorter biceps and the longer torso. Sancho seems to be having long headed biceps similar to Phil Heath if you want and Mark short headed biceps similar to Kai Green. Moving on to the front lat spread we can notice the different styles in execution. I believe Mark focuses on every muscle group in his body, he's flexing the legs, he leans down more whereas Sanj seems to be opening up uh, less and stand tall, or at least this is what I see from this angle. I have to admit that I'm impressed with Sanj's quad sweeps. I would really like to see him in a similar conditioning to what Mark looks here. Side chest pose and if uh, for the first two poses, the front double and the front lat spread, I prefer the Mark uh, Max Muscles execution. In this one I believe Sanj is doing a better job. Actually this is quite fine in, in a way as upper body Mark seems to be adopting a more classic execution, pu pushing his chest out like uh, the golden era guys were doing it, but he's bending the knees like nowadays guys do. Whereas Sanj has a more modern way of hitting this pose upper body, opening up more and not pushing his chest out too much, but he's not bending the knees, similar to bodybuilders before the 90s. Back double biceps and guys, I know I haven't named the winner in each pose, but how could I? Just look at this one for example. Sanj is definitely the bigger guy as I believe this is a Regardless of conditioning, but Marx just slams the door on him with that lower body separation. This is like a contest ready competitor versus an off season competitor. Really hard to judge. But we're doing this for entertaining guys. We as YouTube bodybuilding content creators love bodybuilding, we love bodybuilding comparisons and we sometimes want to have some fun. And this is what these guys are doing here. We just hope you guys would enjoy watching this as much as they did making these uh, routines. What else can we add for the rear lat spread? It's really difficult to notice uh, anything besides the width on Sanj. He also opens up less here just like in the front lat spread. I like how Mark uh, looks in this pose, he's got wide lats and good definition on uh, his back. Side triceps and it's difficult to judge Sanjay's tricep as uh, there's not much separation there due to conditioning and lightning to be honest. But I'm really impressed with that Dorian's calf. Look at that guys. I would really like to see him as uh, conditioned as Mark I repeat and then redo this comparison. As for Mark, this is my favorite pose of him. His tricep uh, lateral head is very thick. I like the semi vacuum as well, great pose Mark. What can I say about the ab and thighs as Sanj is too far in the off season for his abs to be visible but I like his shape, he's got the superior taper and the bigger thighs. Mark has good separation upper body and great separation lower body, his thighs look really really good here. Last pose is the most muscular, I hope I'm not mistaken but for me Sanj is the more muscular guy, but for me to be sure about this I really need to see him more conditioned. As for Mark, his crab most muscular may have become uh, my new favorite pose of him. Look at, that tra look at the traps and the shoulders. Wow Mark, that's really impressive. Okay, so we know this was for entertaining, but I have to name a winner in this matchup. In my opinion, if Sanj would be as conditioned as Mark, he would uh, probably have the edge on this one, I don't know. I hope uh, he gets as conditioned as, as uh, Mark and I also hope that this statement motivates Mark to become even better, but as they look here, Mark is the clear winner, based on conditioning alone, but also based on posing and execution. Based on this footage, Mark is the way better poser. What do you guys think about this comparison? Did you enjoy it? Let me know in the comment section below. Also hit that like button if you want part 2 of this comparison with sound in better condition. Subscribe to the channel, subscribe to Mark's Max Muscle and Sound Bodybuilding if you haven't done it yet. Find links to their channels in the, in the description of this video. 
Thank you guys and see you next time.